You know, they're gonna make a serial about our adventures one day. I've been trying to think of a good title for this episode. I like the sound of the skip job. No, 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 wait, I got it. Hope in dark times. Get it? Hope? Like the ship. That's what folks in the business call wordplay. Yeah, I've been thinking about that. Got a list right here. Thrilling tales of the unreliable. Or maybe spine-chilling stories from the edge of the system. Was also considering astounding adventures in the other. I'm partial to that last one. Right, I'm overdoing it again. Got it. Sorry, boss. I'm just excited, you know? Stealing the hope from the board, skipping it across the whole damn system. <laughs> this is gonna be great. I can't wait. Enough to boost my pay? I'm just kidding, boss. I know you don't pay me. I'm sure you've got plans to make. As for me, I gotta keep practicing my signature dropkick. The hope might have cameras. It sure might. Hey guys, what is up? This is Loosen Up Locks here, and today we're back with some more Outer Worlds. Last time, we would go ahead and steal the chemicals from Byzantium and take them back to Phineas, telling him what their plan was. He told us to try to skip the hope and to Terra 2, which we're going to be trying to do today. Now, I'm going to go ahead and put this out there now. Number one, I did lose an episode in recording. If you guys remember the last two episodes, I've been talking about Max's and... Eight. I've been walking around the ship for the longest time. Anyway. <laughs> anyway, as you guys remember, I've been talking about the uh, companion quest of Max's in Felix's, but as you probably have noticed, I actually haven't shown those companion missions, and that's because I actually had did them, and I lost the footage for them. I don't know where the footage went. I could have sworn I downloaded it to my computer. I cannot find it. So, I will be showing those side quests a little bit later now, but just for context, um, Max's side quest wasn't too big. I mean, it wasn't that big of a deal. All that really happened was that he um, found out about his friend, um, who kind of had wind turncoat um, a little bit, and we had the option to do a couple things, which I'll show when I show it, and then for Max's side quest, he finally just found his answer to the truth, which is why his character is a little bit nicer now. Uh, with that being said, I'm going to go ahead and upgrade my characters to the fullest because of the hope, I believe, does have some pretty strong enemies in it, and I want to be as prepared as possible. Um, last but not least, though, after we do the hope skip, we're going to be doing a lot okay. of side missions. Um, I've been thinking about it, and I'll leave it up to you guys. Do you guys want to see the ending of the game, how it is, with all the companion side quests done? Um, of course, with whatever option I choose. Or would you guys like to see me do the DLC first, after I show all the side quests I want to do, and then we finish the game? Uh, I don't know which one I would like to do. I kind of want to do the other one just in case people want to just see the ending of the game. At the same time, I really want to play the side quests again. I mean, the um, DLCs again, because I've actually only played the Gorgon DLC once. I have played the other DLC twice um, due to me playing it for a whole later. But, with that being said, I will be making that decision or leaving that decision up to you guys, depending on what you guys pick. So, with that being said, we're going to go ahead, I'm going to upgrade my campaigns, or at least the ones I'm going to be taking with me, and yeah, we're going to go ahead and do that. Alright, so we're going to go ahead and go to the Hope Doc. No. I'm impressed, Captain. I almost expected you wouldn't go through with it. Unfortunately, Dr. Wells found a way to corrupt the signal before we could pinpoint his location. Still, it's only a matter of time before we find him. Come visit me in Byzantium. We need to have a talk about the future of this colony. Hmm. Byzantium's a big place. Wait, I have questions. Are so impersonal. I'd like to meet you face to face. Meet me in my office. I've authorized your ship at my personal landing pad. Adjutant Akande has ended her call. Rather rudely, if I might say, considering she didn't sign off. Will there be... Let's go. Huh, okay, so I'm not gonna lie to you guys, I've never done this before. Usually... What the hell was that? Is that Sam? Can we talk? Okay, so... No, I'm sorry, Ellie, we'll talk to you a little bit later. Alright, so I've never actually done this before, so I think we're going to go ahead and do that first. 
Okay, guys, so I just went ahead and cut there. Um, Phineas didn't really show me anything. Ellie's gonna sit there, but I've never, ever done this before. I'm actually quite curious to see what this is. I'm actually gonna make a save here, because I don't want to end up betraying Phineas. I don't know. I don't know. This is crazy. This is crazy. It's for me. I've generally, and I'm not lying, I've generally never seen this before. It's really kind of exciting for me. It's also 4 a.m. I should be asleep, but I'm recording. <laughs> um, let's go ahead and save our game. Um, you can go ahead and get rid of the save right here. Because you don't really need that one anymore. So here's the thing about Tossball. Tossball is played from the heart. Okay. okay. Keep on moving while I talk. So like I said, I've never heart. been here before. That's for sure. Not our other side of thought. Some say you gotta use your head to play Tossball. Those people have concussions. All right, oh. clear it off. Yeah, that sounds um, really dangerous. Okay. Tossball's a celebration of danger. Take the hacker. The hacker's job is to travel. So we right got some items here. Uh, while they're talking, let's see if they got anything worthwhile. Some heavy armor, some medium armor. I really didn't really have anything for us. Yeah, we don't have anything for us either. 59 injuries to his name in three non-consecutive seasons. Why do they call him Take It Easy Tatum? Oh, that's what the mediators used to shout out every time you go into a bloodthirsty frenzy. Oh, no, no, we have been here before, right? Yeah, we've been here before. We just haven't been to that docking bay before, but we've been here before. Yeah, this is all the same stuff. So we've never been in this room. This room was sealed off. So now we can go in here now actually speak to her face to face I admit part of me expected you to stand by your old friend for better or worse Wells was responsible for putting you back on your feet that said he's also a wanted criminal for information regarding his whereabouts you are entitled to collect a reward from Percival hmm What's gonna happen to Wells? The signal you sent us is experiencing some interference. My agents will need time to isolate the problem. We're going to monitor Wells until we're ready to make a move. I asked you here to discuss something far more important. I understand okay. you've infiltrated the Ministry. The things you discovered there must have been shocking, even disturbing. Yes. Halcyon yes. is on the verge of a total systems collapse. The truth is ugly and difficult to accept, but we must accept the truth before we can move forward. Malnutrition is already a problem. Disease will come next, followed by starvation, followed by a breakdown of society, followed by extinction. I know this must come as a surprise to you. I imagine you have questions. So that's your solution? The whole colony on ice? People ain't gonna stand for this. We'll fight back. We'll tear down the walls of Byzantium. No, Mr. Millstone, you will not. The workers of yes, Halcyon will do exactly as they are told, as they always have. Your dreams of a people's nah. revolution are the juvenile fantasies nah. of a frustrated child. Nah, bruh. Is that why we were suffering plague in each one? Malnutrition? All those folks sick and dying, and you knew why the whole time? Yes, Miss Holcomb, we knew why. We've known for some time that Edgewater was dying. The colony itself is dying. The yeah, but we brought Alex. We bought Edgewater back. The starvation will soon spread across Halcyon unless we act. I won't pretend the truth isn't damning. Yes, the colony is on the verge of collapse, but there is a way to save it. No, no, no. We need to talk about this lifetime employment. I'll answer program. however I can. You don't honestly believe all of this. Nonsense. Do you? Now, now let's go ahead and ask all this. That's the main one. That's the main one, right? What's your take when on I all this? I first discovered the truth, I was shocked. Even disgusted. I wondered how we'd allowed a colony like Halcyon to fall into disarray. But the more I thought about it, the more I realized the colony had sown the seeds of its own destruction. We have become lazy and decadent. We smother ourselves in meaningless bureaucracies. We deliberate and argue and procrastinate. It's a pretty good argument to get rid of the board entirely. I admit, 
I occasionally fantasize about making an executive decision without having some tedious committee questioning my every move. Do you have any idea how much paperwork is involved in ordering someone's execution through the usual channels? Are you serious? Paperwork? You're worried about paperwork right now. How long do we We've have? We've already crossed the point of no return. The collapse has already begun. You must have noticed the signs in Hemel Bay. Malnutrition, disease, high mortality rates. This is a permanent famine, Captain. We've done all we can to curb their hunger. Very soon, people are going to realize they're starving. A famine is a problem with logistics as well as marketing. Your workers must remain productive on as little food as possible, and they must always believe that food is plentiful. That's what that research in Roseway was all about. Before you interfered in Roseway, Dr. Anton Crane was on the verge of developing a powerful appetite suppressant. It would have made his career. The solution is a temporary one. Appetite suppressant? Before long, our workers are going to feel the effects of starvation. Yeah, that's the lifetime employment program is our only viable option. What's all this have to do with me? When you turn Phineas Wells over, I knew I could rely. I haven't. You've demonstrated your ability to place duty above sentiment. And you deliver results. That quality alone is enough to separate you from the board's army of indecisive bureaucrats. Not a fan of bureaucracy, huh? Do you know how many meetings I have to sit through? How many papers I have to sign before I can make one decision? I'm only trying to rescue Halcyon from extinction. I can't save this colony alone. I need someone capable of working outside the system. Someone who can get things done. Oh, I'm gonna get things done because there's no way you believe in all this nonsense. The Lifetime Employment Program is not some malevolent strategy of an evil mastermind. There's no dark secret buried in the fine print. The program is logical, it's reasonable, it's merciful, and most importantly, it will work. <laughs> but the rest of the colony star, I'm gonna keep my heels in Brazantium. No, 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 no. I saw the presentation. No, no, this is the only way. Finish. Wells has a plan. He does not have a plan. He has an okay. obsession. He is obsessed with reviving the Hope's colonists, no matter the Yeah, cost. that's the plan, dumbass. Halcyon is already starving. We can't possibly introduce tens of thousands of new colonists into the system. Help me execute the Lifetime Employment Program, and you will have come to a place of honor in Byzantium. You will More questions. Tell me why you wanted to see me. to talk about Emerald Vale. You handed what about Emerald Vale? to a band of dissidents. I can't have this. Adelaide McDevitt and her people have no place in the Halcyon that is to come. Edgewater needs what? to go. I want you to wipe the town out. No survivors. Are what the hell? Mind? We're not gonna murder a town of innocent people. You will do exactly as you're told, or I will have you shot for insubordination. Are you serious? Someone has to be. Oh, no, hell no. I need a decision from you. You're completely hmm. insane. Allowing thousands of colonists to starve to death because we couldn't make one cold-blooded decision is insane. What I'm suggesting no. is absolutely You're logical. not thinking logically. You won't even listen. I am responsible for every single human life in this country. Oh, I'm about to be responsible for Do something in a second. I relish the thought of killing some of them to save the rest? Steal your spine, Captain. Don't make no. this more difficult than it needs to be, Captain. I rather like you. And I'd hate to have you shot for disobeying a direct order. I don't really have a choice, Not do sure. I? You can choose to say, yes, ma'am, or at I'm disappointed. Go to hell. I was so sure you had potential. I knew this. Whoa, whoa, here we go. We're not dying here. We're not dying here. We're not dying here. We're not dying here. Thank you, Barbarty. Yo, I can't believe this. 
I've never- I can't believe I've never done this before. Guys. I'm stunned. I've never- when I tell you that I've never done this part before, I've never done this part before. Ever. But it's over now. It's over now. We're gonna go to the Hope Docking Bay. We're gonna skip this hey, shit. Oh, we're gonna have to do a lot of fighting. Oh shit. We're gonna have to do a lot of fighting. I didn't even notice. Look at all the red dots. The entire town of Brazantium is going to be on our ass. Alright, come on. Tough fight ahead, tough fight ahead. Barty? We're killing everyone in this bitch. I don't give a fuck. Mm. 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 Here we go, here we go. Look at Barty, huh? Why are you crouching over there? Oh no, Felix, no! I wanted to use your drop in that person, was okay. You did good, Felix. Look how much damage you did. Yeah, let's go. Oh, you shit. Who else is left? Who wants next? Someone left. Someone that ran away. They upstairs? They might be upstairs still. Where are they? Are they, they on the second floor? They have to be. They have to be like up here or something. How do we get up there? Can we get up there? I think we can. Sorry, I killed some of the residents. My bad, y'all. Yeah, right here. So I believe we take this one. The other thing about Tosco? Tosco? It's all about scoring goals. Scoring goals, that's And you can score a goal by kicking the ball, throwing the ball, or... Okay, so here we go. So yeah, these were the other ones. Oh god! There's my camera, baby. Solves all your problems. Look at, the, look at the damage you're doing. Ooh, look at that. That was a nice helmet, actually. I think we're gonna go ahead and give that to Felix since he probably is gonna go ahead and rush up to people and start bashing them in the head. So we'll go ahead and give that to him. Let's give him a armor. Alright, well, we just killed the head of the board. I can't believe that just happened still. Alright, well. After that big fight, after that talk, I, I can't believe, I still can't believe that just happened. I can't believe that just happened. Wow. It's all the wow. The, does the crew the crew has to have some type of reaction to that, right? They have to, Pavardi. Hey, Captain. All right, she's gonna do her second. I got a thing I want to ask you. It's kind of big. Well, all right, now's like a time. When you got time, you think maybe I could get a bit of it? It's. Yeah, sure thing, Pavardi. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, Pavardi. I'm sorry. Can we talk? That was her you side quest. Adjutant. We are outlaws in the truest sense of the word now. Welcome back, Captain. Sure are. How can I be of assistance? Mention the trauma. Mm -hmm. I'll talk to you later. Okay. Let's go to the Hope. Let's do this. We have arrived at the Hope. I need you to reroute power from our ship to the Hope's auxiliary generator. 
You'll have to connect me to the hoax comm system so I can convince her central computer to enable the skip drive. What happens if, if I skip your calculations are even slightly off? You could crash the entire colony ship into Terra too. Or the sun. What was I doing again? Be an early warning sign of asphyxiation due to loss of pressurization. Are you breathing comfortably, Captain? I need you to reroute power from our ship to the Hope's auxiliary generator. You'll have to connect me to the Hope's comm system so I can convince her central computer to enable the skip drive. That's all for now. Alright, we leveled level 25. I believe level 25 is the max level if you don't have the DLC, but I could be wrong about that. It could be level 3. Um, but with getting to level 25, we have 10 new points to spend. And I think I'm going to spend them before I get off of here. Hmm, what do I want to spend it on, though, is quite the question I have, huh? I do want to get this one 100, because power sweeps and a power attacks have 25% chance to knock down. So I kind of want to get that up, but at the same time... Yeah, like I said, we have a lot of levels to work with. I think we're all just going to level this up some. All 10 perks instead. that. Alright, I chose to take Felix and Pravardi with me on this mission. Um, I gave Felix the new um, grenade launcher last episode, I believe. And I also gave him a pro toss ball stick, so he's going to be doing more damage with his toss ball stick. Or toss ball blocker, sorry. When he does decide to go ahead and use it for melee. Uh, he's, I have like the only character I have currently that is, has mixed aggression so far. Every other character is more of a... You can build them to a melee character, but I think Felix is the only one that is just straight up a no melee character. Here we are. Here we go. We're on the hook. We got host comms, and we're here. First things first. The patch. Okay. For power. That ought to do it. Now we got some enemies working here. Bah! Uh oh, hello. I said the Hope does have some pretty strong... Who is this? Who are you? You have a unique name. Hey, you have another one of those helmets. I'll go ahead and go ahead and give that to... Oh, they have their other perks. I'll go ahead and give that to them in a second. I don't believe I can now because they're... Oh, they're... Okay, I could. I'll do that later. Let me forget, guys. Party. So we get a key card. I don't know who that was, but. Okay. Just a little lock picking thing. From Rats. Good there, it's alright though. Alright, let's keep on pushing. Pushing P. Ooh, okay. I'm just gonna. Mm. Mm. Killing everybody. Our sneak's pretty high, so I can go ahead and do that pretty easily. Get some uh, good armor here. Not gonna lie, but yeah, we are killing everyone though. I'm not even. I'm gonna try to play a little stealthy, but not too stealthy. Basically. Alright, so. Those comms are clear. Okay, pick lock, that's cool. Continue. Hey, yeah, board up for around the trouts. Yeah, but I've got bridge duty. I'll come up as me and sure I don't cheat. Listen, it's not cheating if you don't get caught. I'm expecting the deck all the same. Okay, you know what? I just didn't play anything instead. <laughs> Some more stuff here. I'm not gonna use that on that tiny box. I'm gonna get this door. And that's gonna let us bypass most of this stuff. Yeah, it is. Cool. So we actually don't have to go to that thing of robots. It is a, quite a bit of XP we're missing out on though. I was in one of the pods that just woke up. Hibernation pod access is illegal. State your employer. 
Registry. Um, UDO. A fine of 10,000 bits will be assessed in your corporation ledger for 10,000 bits. Proper hibernation pod procedures. Thank you for your cooperation. 10,000 bits. Fuck that. Fuck that. 10,000 bits. What? Um, you guys can hearing nothing, you can open this door, the robot. Functional. Nine 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 nine. Is anyone who wants to scratch my name on one of those pods? Yeah, I figured. This is where we came from, guys. This is where Phineas got us from. As you can see, you kinda can you can even see the missing pod. He did take more than one, though. But you can see some of the missing pods. Alright, though. Into something else here. I'm just gonna go ahead and attack the Loki. Alright, our dopes comes. Reroute the communication to the unreliable. Can you hear me, Captain? I have successfully yes, sir. I'm in man. into the Hope's system. And I'm attempting to establish contact with the host. More primitive processor now. Would you like me to play a mood suitable music selection while you travel to the bridge? Oh, sorry. File not found. Thanks, Ada. <laughs> I'll get another door to unlock. Ooh, get a mega spread. Um, you're probably hostile, aren't you? Ooh, that's a lot of help. Um, Felix. Oh, he inflicted terror. Intimidation. Good on you, Felix. Sorry, Sprat. Actually, really. No, we like completely destroyed him just now. You did give us an in raid, though, for modding. Oh. Look at that. Um, I'm sure I have something to say about this? I'm pretty sure they had something to say about this. Usually they do. I don't know if like, I'm sorry or something like that. So it looks like we have a, another failed hope thing, it seems like. Maybe because there's enemies? I don't know. Because what I'm about to do to you. Or oh, actually, never mind. Computer up ahead. I'll admit, I am curious to wait. Me too. I knew they were sisters, but yeah, I know. I kind of just not killed you. Sorry, kind of interrupted Ferrari's dialogue there. These were the private quarters of the. Sorry, once again. Private quarters of the hopes of troops, basically. My bad. You can pause it to read what it says. Don't worry about all that, man. In your business. I actually didn't see you there. Yeah, I'm pretty sure we're, no, we're not over encumbered. But I'm definitely picking up a lot more weapons than I should be. Hello. Just saw all these dead bodies looking around. Saw me not panicking, thought it was normal, huh? Alright. Now we are at the Hope Bridge. Let's do this. Comms. Well, let's look at their other status. Sorry, status. Continue. Logs. No transcript. Open the fucking doors. That no, you're killing us. Better than oh. Zayotic. Don't 
gonna keep the ship afloat with Dodai anyway, and the Surrey Risk, Rizzi. Flooding the courts, the ship will fly free. Gambling with a hundred thousand people's lives. Do you feel it's your fucking drill? Okay. The drill stopped. Maybe we're taking a break. Maybe it broke. Maybe they're trying to get the cold storage we get through before they start. They'll outlast us. Before you do this, tell me, Ada, am I doing the right thing? Potentially kill an entire planet. How is my humor now, Captain? Improved? Hang on, you take care of Are you leaving me with the Hope's computer? You have no idea what it's like to converse with him. Imagine, simulate another organic jostling your circuits when he tries to. I mean, I'll be ready when you are, Captain. <laughs> what the hell? <laughs> okay. Uh, what? Honey? Are you sufficiently prepared for the. Are you sure? I'm ready. And also, jump starting skip, it. skip drive. Destination set to the rings of Terra 2. I'm I skipping it myself. That, Worst ways to go out, I suppose. It's nice knowing you, boss. I know what I'm doing. I got intelligence and science All over right. 80. It is in your hands now, Captain. I trust you, in so much as my presets allow. ADA. Does your captain seriously intend to do a micro jump in system with engines that haven't been powered in 70 years on a derelict ship? That is what my captain intends, yes. But that is a yep. gross misuse of the skip drive. The Zero Point Drives Corp and I will not be held responsible for any damage incurred during transport, and this will cause extreme damage. Yes, you know. I am aware of that. You, you can should do it, not though. be doing this. The humans will die. Thank you, Hope. It looks like all systems are go. Captain, I would advise you to hold on to something. Now. I shall. Here we go. successfully oh, yeah. into Terra 2's orbit. I reported as much to Phineas Wells, but he has not responded. Perhaps you should check in on him. Oh, oh. Let's not do that again. Where, where are you? <laughs> the thing's just really muffled, but let's go talk to Phineas. Tell him that we've done... What the f... Okay. All right. Ghost Pavardi. Alright, let's go talk to Phineas, though. And tell him that it is done. And, ooh, yeah, we have people dead here and stuff. We didn't kill these people. Captain, I am receiving a transmission from Dr. Well. Captain. I shall now play the transmission uh -oh. I received from Dr. Wells. Thank the Lord you warned me. I was able to get some defenses up, but they might not be enough. 
The board oh, has no. sent some serious firepower to pry me out of here. They're trying to get in here, and I'm not sure I can stop them. If they capture me, if we can't communicate again, there's something very important you need to remember. The board, What's up? all their lackeys, they're all a bunch of swine. You hear me? They're fucking corporate I hear you. swine. You I know. Pig. I'll take you all out with me. I'll never. Uh oh. Got through. Damn it, I thought. Damn it. Yes. No. Alright, we need to go there right now. Hopefully, maybe we can do something about it. Um, I didn't think they were going to invade so since we killed the head of the board, so she didn't really have a word to send to find Phineas. Not top secret anymore, huh? Let's go. Let's go, guys. We're gonna have to do a little more fighting here. Let's do this. I hope you guys have been enjoying this episode. I really enjoyed playing this game with you guys. We're almost to the end, but not quite yet. Really, really good. Let's go. It's Phineas. He's still. Phineas, please don't be dead, Phineas. I'm coming for you. Get out the way! <laughs> 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 Uh. I mean, shit. There's more, there's more. It, oh, damn it, I was gonna drop it. Oh, Jesus. Almost got myself killed there. Ooh, look at that. That's some really nice armor. Level 50. Colonel Safe Gold. Okay, so this is a rare weapon they can drop that already has in on it. And it's a better version of Colonel Safe. But what we need to do now is we need to. to have 80 hat to bypass this, which is something I never really liked about this game, but good thing we did just level up, and our hat's at 60 right now, so we can do so we can level it up to um, 70, and I'm going to go ahead and we're going to level up these perks, I'm going to go back and get Max because he has hack, a 10 plus hack skill, and I'll see you guys when we come back here, but first I'm going to do stuff, right? Bonuses for mods are not affected. I mean, that's not bad. I'll do that. So we'll go to Super Hacking next for sure. Helix, and your tier 5 perk, second event. Same second one perk as well. Alright, so I'm done upgrading. I haven't come back yet. I'm just gonna. Yeah, I can't do this now. First things first, I'm gonna go ahead and see if we have any armor. Alright, so we're back. I got Max with me, which means we're gonna be able to bypass. Only. Speed of Legion Eternal and until I'm looking for his entry. Halcyon, 25 years too late. It's another one to go into the entire ship. All this, so naturally, they're gonna leave him there. Corbett tells us probably it was impossible. They've tried absolutely nothing and apparently they're all out of options. Later death, stellar regeneration, long term hibernation. It's really just a question of. Uh, okay, I don't know how to say that word. I'm confident we'll find a way to revive them. So basically, that's him saying that I'm gonna go try to revive them. So, okay, so, so. This is him trying to revive him. On to subject number 13. He told subject to die. I don't know how much longer he's been doing. He's been doing thousands of calls. 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 He's been doing I've always expected this would happen. The fourth finally discovered what I've done. They sent their headhunters to track me down, but never find me. 
could say I'm a murderer, and they're right. I am. I don't care what I've done, but I'm not about to turn myself into a fool. I'm not going to beg for this forgiveness. I want the most calmness can forgive me for what I've done. The only people who I can set things right with. I'm going to find a way to survive no matter how long I have to stay in hiding. I got my nose from me, I have to live Now I have this lab. It's time to return to my work. This secret panel. This gives us Tartarus Nav Key. We can now fast travel to where Phineas is being held. Fast traveling here is going to be the final mission of the game. Confronting the chairman is the final mission of the game. Once you do this, the game will end. There is a quick save that happens right before you go ahead and talk to the chairman of whoever's going to be there. I'm actually not sure who's going to be there, considering that we just killed the head of the board. So we aren't going to do that right now. The next two episodes of Idle Worlds are going to be completely side quests and companion quests out. Um, side quests that I want to show you guys before we go ahead and do the final mission. Leave your suggestions in the comment section below if you guys would like to see the ending right away, or if you want me to play through both of the DLCs and then see the ending. I'm going to show both of the endings probably anyway, or I can just show one of them, but I really don't know. I'll leave it to you guys to decide. I'll make a poll even. That being said, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. We did a lot today. Like, comment, subscribe if you did enjoy it. I hope you guys have been enjoying this playthrough as I have. I'll see you guys next time. Stay safe out there and stay tuned.